What's up guys? DJ Beanpole here. Welcome to uh, DJ Beanpole's Kitchen. Uh, I decided to change things up a little bit for you guys because I'm getting down to the end of what I got left uh, in my Creatrona and my Max Pump, which is right here, which I had some better lighting. It's right here. Um, there's not, not really a whole lot left going on in there. Maybe four workouts left after today. Oops. Maybe four left after today. So I thought I would show you guys a little bit because I haven't done it in a while. Some of the mixability here of uh, yours truly's Stimulate right there. So we're, I got my Phenoflex cup right here. I'm going to give you guys a little lesson on how to mix up your pre-workout. First you're going to need the Phenoflex shaker cup. If you don't have one, that's okay, but you won't be adding 10 pound PRs daily. Just saying. You're doing a supplement review log and you have the supplement in its own company shaker cup, guaranteed 10 pound PR. Now I already shook this up and so it's done doing its smoking thing here. I got the scoop on the outside. Today, because it's so early in the morning, you guys can tell I am not awake yet. We're going to do a full scoop of that guy. Well, it's not, not quite to the top, so I wouldn't say it's leveled off, but it's full scoop. I'm going to put that in there. And you can see it kind of drift down to the bottom. It stays kind of in a big clump and then it all just, there it goes, just plummeted right down to the bottom. Now Fetaflex and their uh, shaker cup they sent me has this nice like sifter in it, which really helps break everything up. I'll put this on. Make sure the lid's closed tight, don't want it to explode everywhere. I'm going to shake it. This is your uh, arm day warm up right here. Shake it up, maybe 15, 10, 15 seconds. I don't know how long I've been doing it. You wait. Bring it up by the light. Turns this really cool shade of green. Can already, even with the lid closed, can already kind of smell it. It's mixing up. It gets a little bit ahead at the top, but that happens with most pre-workout. You let it settle out for a second, you shake it back up, you're good to go. So I'm going to take my 4Max pump right now. Today is uh, shoulder day. I meant to do it yesterday, but I had a really bad headache. So uh, I held off on going to the gym. I usually don't get headaches that bad, but yesterday it was uh, kind of unique. It was a little different day. It was kind of crazy. A couple more shakes. This is about all the water you would need for one scoop. I mean, this is a little, a little shaker cup. Let me show you the comparison here. Put these max pumps down. So here's a Phenoflex shaker cup. Look at the size of my hand around this. And here is a regular shaker cup. So I mean this is pretty tiny and this is really all you need. So I'm gonna grab my max pump. Max pump boys. All four of them at once. Don't give a F. Toss it back. Love this freaking flavor. And Pete did too when he took it. This is uh, this is Apple Blast. It is delicious. Flavoring for Phenoflex, right on the money. Mm, I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna get stimulated, I'm gonna go crush some shoulders, and you guys will hear about it after I'm done. DJ signing off.
What's up guys, DJ Beanpole, leaving the gym exhausted, got a lot of things done today, it was shoulder day, overhead press 145 for 5, one at 6 but I'll take 5, it was 5 through one day, as long as I get more than one we're good, apologize for wearing the sunglasses, y'all can't see my beautiful eyes, it is very sunny outside right now, colder than H, but very sunny outside. I'm gonna try to make this video the, the G-rated video, so the Fenaflex, so you guys can put it on Facebook. Anyway, had a great productive day in the gym. Really had a good uh, energy going on. I didn't have any uh, overstimulation, nothing like that. Max pump, uh, pumps kicked in more towards the ancillary workouts. Um, I usually don't feel pumps in my primary workouts, um, no matter what. Uh, so overhead press, didn't really feel anything. Went on a close grip bench, didn't really feel anything. And then I got huge surges of energy for both shrugs, which I got 325 for 10 on the fifth set, and then uh, bent over row, or excuse me, pen lay row, uh, I got uh, 175, I think, for 10 that was also on the fifth set. So uh, that stuff came out of nowhere, and then I moved on to like bicep curls and tricep pushdowns, uh, and I definitely feel pumps on those, just because it's, it's such an one isolation exercise, you're just working on one muscle group, uh, instead of the compound exercises, so I definitely feel the pumps a lot more on those. So anyway, going to go home, going to take my uh, pre, uh, pre workout going to take my uh, post-workout beverage, um, and uh, throw down some Cricket Toronto, get my post-workout meal in. I even did a 15-minute stationary bike hit after the workout was done. I wanted to go home, and I was like, nah, man, you're fasted, just do some hit, burn off some extra fat. So we're trying, cutting season has begun, I've been in cutting season for almost a month now, so uh, slow cut, very, very slow cut, I'm slowly taking down the carbs. Good stuff happening in the gym today. I'm having a great time with the uh, Phenoflex. I'm getting sad that it's almost over. Big shout out to my locker room family, my Anabolic Minds forum family, uh, and all the other forums I'm gonna be a part of soon. Um, I am now a, um, no, I better not say that. We'll save that for later. So this is DJ Beanpole. You can find me at DJ Beanpole on Twitter, djbeanpole.com. And if you're already watching this, then you know where you're at. YouTube.com slash DJ Beanpole reviews you guys have any questions, comments, got products you want me to see me review later on down the road, hit me up. Uh, so there's probably only a couple more workouts left with this uh, stack, and then I will be moving on to something else. Uh, we'll do the final review probably next week, uh, and then I will uh, explain to you guys what's going on after that. So this is DJ. Stay tuned.